too without my region, the region of my residence. Okay, I have to give credit to my boss and that is the greater Accra region. The region for every foreigner. You get to get here first before you go to any other region in Ghana as a foreigner. So that is why today I'm going back to my city. Today we are going to Accra Academy. The government schools in Ghana are making me want to cry. But anyways, I'm a strong girl, you know, now I'm a hard girl. So if you're new here, hi, my name is Lilian. And to all of you that have been on this journey with me, I appreciate you. Thank you so much for tuning in again to see another one. So today I'm taking you to Accra Academy located in the greater Accra region of Ghana. And let's go check these guys, check these guys out and I'll be back. Let's go. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Accra Academy is a day and boarding boys school located in the greater Accra region of Ghana. The school was established on July 20th, 1931 and has risen to become one of the most prestigious high schools in Ghana. Academy is represented by Ibuda Akorichmo, final year. Awuye Marcelinos Agbenyega, final year. Great, Accra Academy. Find the shortest wavelength in the Brem Stralang. Yes, Ibu. Yes, you are right. I have four HNO3 plus SN going into SNO2 plus 4NO2 plus 2H2O. Yes. You see why I can't stop doing these videos. See, 
sometimes when I want to be demotivated, I will go back to the old videos I have done on this series and I will be motivated. I'll be changed. There are some things we do for love and this series is one of them. So I'm going to be on it. Okay. And these are the reasons when you're talking about Ghana, you have something to show. There is something for me to say, see, I'm take i'm not just talking about imaginary success and achievement or basically sitting down and celebrating a musician who is moving around buying gushy back for i will not you know just basically sit down and celebrate people's personal ach achievements so this is why i'm on this series because man i'm talking about a system that is open to everybody including people with similar backgrounds like mine where you have to queue up if the government didn't do something to aid the pride of the citizens it means that you have to queue like i did queue before going to school like i went to school late because i had to wait for my sisters to be done before my mom could afford my own school fees and sometimes i miss i don't go to school sometimes i have to walk and save up so that I can return to school. Oh, you see, if my system was there to help my parents, all of that wouldn't have been, you know, the case. So when I see a system that don't put people, don't put our youth through that trauma, I love it and I will always celebrate. Now, let's go check out their old boys. You know, Akrana, eh? Doings, doings. This school has produced so many people. Let's go check them out and I'll be back. Let's go. <laughs> Image is in a dano. I always say crack cadame. They are like some school boys. I'm from mash up in a dano. I don't see them like that. I don't see them like that. Get them like that. Where are the missions? Are you here? Bill B. Ready? Three, two, one. Agra, Agra, Dene, Agra. Please come. No, I just raised the tune. I want you to join me. So we'll go there and we'll sing it. Please, a round of applause for the academicians. Please go ahead and thank you. For some of them, I've seen them first time in 20 years. Thank you, thank you. Just here, Japan. Thank you. God bless you. Prime Saban. So are we ready? Who's raising the tune for us? For this great school? The song. We're going to do the song. Okay, let's yeah. do the song. Accra Academy of Pride, the school of no regrets. In her own little minds worship to serve a nation great. Oh Lord, to the we dedicate Accra Academy. As a kwam we dare we say and blow a cry, a cry. <laughs> Oh, there you go. Thank you very much. We'll be here to deliver our project and we welcome you to continue with the work. Thank you very much. Thank you, blow 90 to 91. And we are glad you've taken over now. Thank you. Um, can I call the chairman, the board chairman, and the headmaster, please, to help us cut the cake? Please, 90 year group, stay there, don't move. So, the chairman, the board chairman, and the headmaster, the guest of honor, Dr. Boche and Julian, please come forward here and then help us cut the cake. And after that, the chairman will give his closing remarks. Please, 
can you form an arc so that there's some form of yeah those taking the pictures can move down their way go back a bit so you can capture everyone i hope we have the aoba yes president here yeah so please when we came into this school 14th of October 1985 was the first time we stepped here and we left in 92. So some of us came with our trunk and chop box. So this is the representative of our journey from October to now. Thank God we are alive. So we cut a cake to celebrate our time in being in the school and giving back to the school. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And yeah, so Chairman. Board Chairman, you can take your seat and then the Chairman for the occasion will give us his closing remarks and then we will be about to round up. I know time is fast spent, but thank you for bearing with us. Activities about the anniversary founded by the 1990-year group includes refurbishment of a one-story, ten-unit classroom block with furniture, landscaping and green, and donation of 60 pairs of uniforms and combat boots for the school's cadet corps. when i'm doing a video about anything in ghana i love the fact that at night i can sleep well because i'm not lying everything i'm saying about ghana is how i truly feel and that is how my soul is feeling so for those campaigning so that these videos will stop you have a job to do you have to apply pressure <laughs> let's go back to the school and take a look at everything we can find and i will be back let's go <laughs>
So this is the American Embassy, led by Kukui Siao and the Blue Regimental Band. It's about the various stripes in Ghana and how they handle the American Embassy interviews in Ghana. Is the first blood regimental band formed and ready to have a high life groove. Left hand, right hand, left hand, right hand. The only person that will look at this to be regular thing to be normal when you are not from systems that are working you are from a country like mine where you are a slave in your own country and due to that people are willing to live in the jungle rather than live there because it's not easy I, I can't begin to tell you guys the things that are going on I can't begin to tell you what people are going through and we have other people who don't care I used to talk about the attitude of people from my country right I talked, I used to talk about how selfish, how self-centered. Um, now, now that, now I hope people can see how Ghanaians are giving back to their community. They are giving back to their community. You as a Ghanaian, you go to school. When you are done, you have a duty. And that duty is for you to remember that you have to help your community. Because this is a part of you. Tell me how I won't celebrate a system like that. Please share this video with your Nigerian or two. I hope that you guys will tune in again to see the next school on our list. So with that being said, I'm going. I'll see you again another time. Ciao.